And that's not going to happen because as this compresses, we get to a certain point, that spark plug is going to fire and then we're right away into the combustion stroke. So let's talk a little bit more about the bang. You know, obviously the really important part of everything, right? The bang or the combustion cycle, stroke, cycle, whatever you want to call it. It's not really a bang. If it were a bang, it'd be considered detonation. And detonation that happens inside the combustion chamber is not a great thing, usually causes damage. What actually happens inside the combustion chamber is called flagration. Flagration is basically a controlled burn, right? That's where the fuel and air is going to go ahead and ignite in a very controlled in constant manner. And when they control this, where this burn happens and how it happens, what they're doing is they're controlling what's called the flame front. So this flagration burn, this can be controlled by the depth of the spark plug, the angle of the spark plug, how far the spark plug sits in the chamber, the shape of the piston, the shape of the combustion chamber itself. And that's why you want to have things generally kind of smooth inside the combustion chamber because any sharp edges, you could end up with those detonation moments. <clears throat> like I was saying earlier, this gets real technical real fast. And there are people that specialize in this stuff and entire R&D departments that decide how this stuff happens. We can dive into these a little bit deeper later if you'd like to, if that's something that sounds interesting. Just know that controlling the swirl, the squish, and the flame front can dramatically increase the types of compression you can use, how much boost you can run in an engine, the type of fuel you can use. You name it, everything affects everything. 